This is a sawmill. They appear on saws made before World War I, and they have mystified craftsmen ever since. If you explore the internet, you'll find that these things are built in compasses, parallel rules, back scratchers, every other crazy thing. My grandfather, who was born on the far side of World War I, knew exactly what they were. They're there to help you obey the first commandment of hand sawing. Use the whole saw. When you saw, you must use all the saw teeth. If you don't, the saw will wear in the middle and it will soon look like a backward scimitar, a kukri. So you pull back until you see the nib and then, and only then, push forward. The nib is especially handy when ripping a long board or cross-cutting a wide one because you can't see the end of the saw. There, mystery solved.